Right now, a strike is on the table for Charlotte transit workers. This is coming after months of contract negotiations. WCNC Charlotte's Jesse Pierre has been following the story for us, joining us live now. So, Jesse, what is the latest? Well, sources tell me that two contracts have been rejected by CATS operators who are represented by the Smart Union. So the next vote's happening tomorrow, and that is where workers will decide if a strike is their next move. Once the workers are organized, management is legally obligated to negotiate with that group of workers over their wages and benefits and other conditions of employment. Kat says negotiations are ongoing with Smart Union and with RATP Dev, the company that manages the bus operators. And due to state law, the city of Charlotte nor the agency itself have a say in these agreements. We cannot get into uh, bargaining agreements with unions. So that's why there is a uh, agency, RATP Dev, that actually works with the union um, and they hire uh, operators and they are the ones who are responsible for uh, ongoing uh, concerns with, with the operators. Katz says it is aware of a strike vote on Saturday. It's a move economics professor Stephen Allen says is not uncommon when parties cannot agree on the final terms of a labor contract. You're sending to management a signal that you're very, very serious about uh, working conditions and compensation at the workplace. Allen says voting to authorize a strike keeps things in order and lawful. If the union were to go out on strike without going through the process, it would be called a wildcat strike. The management could get an injunction uh, forcing them to go back to work. Kat says it is important to note if the majority votes yes on Saturday, it does not mean the union will strike that same day, but that the union could go on strike in the future. Now, bus drivers say that pay, health insurance, job security, and changes to the point system for unexcused absences were big concerns that led to rejecting the contract. Live in Southwest Charlotte, Jesse Pierre, WCNC Charlotte. Jesse, thanks so much.